You're watching RVT Rashid's Teletube, serving nations worldwide. Up next on RVT, Rashid's video too. It's the Rashid and Jan show. Following that is Rashid Cyber 2. Having a keen eye for Rashid Entertainment isn't hard to do, especially when you're here on RVT, where it's Rashid all the time. You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? You're watching Rashid's RVT. Hello everybody, this is Rashid. And I want to personally thank you so much for so many YouTube subscribers. And together with the millions of views on my Google page, I think it's safe to say we're well on our way, huh guys? Thanks for making RVT so successful. So I tell you what, you keep doing what you do, and we'll do the same round here. Deal? Deal. So relax. This is RVT, Rashid's video tool. Where's Rashid all the time? Oh, what an atmosphere. Thank you. 
This RVT Rashid's video 2 broadcasting is brought to you partly by the Rashid and Jan show and by delicious refreshing strawberry milk. Drink an explosion of strawberry flavor in every drop. So like Rashid and Jan say, drink up! You're watching RVT Rashid's video 2. Oh, what an atmosphere. You're watching RVT, an international broadcasting station. Isabella, Rashid's startling adventurous computer novel created and written by Rashid. A Rashid Greek mythology story narrated by Rashid himself. Now streaming on RVT Rashid's video tube. Come follow along today. Oh, I feel so terrible. What's the matter, guy? Oh, you wouldn't understand. Oh, come on. It can't be all that bad. Okay, if I must, Rashid, I'll tell it to you. I have no sweets this year. You have no sweets? Well, that's not good. No, it's not good at all. I want something sugary. I want something delicious. Here, side dear. Try some chocolate bites. Chocolate bites? Yup, chocolate bites. Tiny chocolate bits wrapped up. After dinner or evening leisure. They're great. Hmm, chocolate bites. Hey, guy. Yeah? Are you feeling any better? As long as I got my chocolate bites. I know, I know. So, guys, when you're out, pick some up. It's great. Ah, such a beautiful morning. I'm ready to tackle on a day. Boy, I feel great. Growl! I've been waiting all night. Can't take it anymore. It's okay. It's okay. Just choose. Okay, uh, this one. Ah, no, no, that one. This one. <laughs> Wait, let's take a look. Hmm. Mm hmm. There's a wide variety of cereals to choose from. All good for you with a key element in staying in perfect health. Fiber and whole grains for a perfect and healthy heart. More so healthy than vegetables itself and tastes great. I can't take it anymore. Okay, here you go. My goodness. Oh, there you are. I thought I lost you for a second. So rather than small economy or standard size, cold or hot, make sure you fuel up every day to bring out your award-winning smile. Your heart will thank you. See ya.
Look on your social devices. It's a bird. It's a plane. No, it's my cheese mansion's mouse. And I want to help you guys get a good night's rest. Take a look. Oh, my back. Oh. Oh. Why should you guys suffer with stiff back, achy joints, and so on from a worn out mattress? There are hundreds of affordable mattress dealers in your area. And all is needed is you. Reliable mattresses that fit your comfort level. Spring design style, chic and firm. Thank you, Rashi Mattress Moles. Anytime, an RET ad is worth two in a hole. And speaking of ads, don't forget about this one. And size your bedding up for comfort. A new mattress and a good night's rest awaits you. Just go to www.mattress.com. That's www.mattress.com. Uh, anyway. Hey guys, let me tell you about this great music floating around RBC Rashid's video tube, Rashid's karaoke. Oh, you can't beat these sounds. Yesteryear sounds, rockin' sounds that we rock to. Here's a few coming right at you. Just check it out. All found on RMJC Rashid's Music Jukebox Center. Rashid's Karaoke, singing some of the greatest past hits of yesteryear. Here's more. Yo, who said disco is dead? Studio 54 favorites. Bark, bark, bark! You know it. So come freak out because the freak is back. Growl! Now streaming, hit the Rashid's video.
Oh, what a marvelous world it is today. You're watching Rashid's World on RVT, Rashid's Video Tube. You sure are, folks! Why is delicious hot oatmeal so good for so many families? Oatmeal is rich in protein. A breakfast with delicious oatmeal with milk and sugar for a family of four provides as much total protein as six average eggs. As much total protein as 18 pieces of toast. And almost as total protein as 18 strips of bacon. That's why your family get that wonderful stick to the ribs feeling with hot oatmeal. That wonderful feeling of well-being with only one minute of actual cooking time. So be sure your family get the protein they need with the delicious hot breakfast of hot oatmeal. Just go over to www.oatmeal.org. That's www.oatmeal.org. Put it on this, spread it on that, a little on this, and a whole lot of that. Everything's better with butter. Whip it on this, a little on that. Smear it on this, and square it on that. Everything's better with butter. Now you can square it up with butter or margarine. Electrify your taste buds with the rich and satisfying taste of butter. Whip it on this, graze it on that. Square it on rice, now that's... Where is that? Everything's better with butter. Now get to the grocers and square it up. Also in spray style to go easy on bread. Quick guys, run for the hills! Ah! Everybody run! Oh! Everybody run! Ah! Look out! RVT. You're watching RVT, an international broadcasting station. You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid? All the time. You're watching Rashi's RVT. Your adventure starts here. Luggage from top names over 65% off. Just surf over to www.luggage.com. That's www.luggage.com. And now, enjoy the show. Hey everybody, welcome to RVT. This is RVT, Rashid's Video Tube, because you actually are JC, Rashid's Music Jukebox Center. And I'm Rashid Arman, <laughs> on social media, Google Plus, YouTube, on social media, platforms, Instagram, and the like. 
Um, thank you guys for tuning in. I'm playing with my dog right here. So, my brain is, well, I can't help it. I can't help it. She, she wants attention. So, yeah, so, yeah, check it out, man. So, the, this episode, this show right here, I'm still promoting, of course, Aqua Rangers, R-O-Y-S, Easy Girl. Don't start the bro growling shit. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Don't start the growling shit. Aqua Rangers, R-O-Y-S. I'm still promoting that. And I figured, like, before how I brought to the show, we went underwater. And I started talking about different sea life. The, the fish and the sharks and stuff. So I figure I'd do the same for this show right here. Now I hope you guys are in the mood to look at some good sea life pictures. Some I have information for. Some I don't. But that's not the only thing we're going to talk about. We're going to talk about other things too. But you'll see as we go on. I'm glad you guys are here. You'll be anywhere on social media but you're here and it makes me happy. So I'm very excited about doing this this animation guys. I'm really excited. Now, this is different than yesterday. Yesterday was just a bunch of <laughs> irate talking. But this is just, I think, I think I'll give us something decent to look at. So, to get my personal opinions about um, what's going on here. To be able to do science fiction, guys, makes you crazy. It makes you start thinking outside of the box, so to speak. You start, you start thinking... Not hallucin. We're not thinking hallucinatory uh, thoughts, but we're thinking loose thoughts. We're thinking what can be thoughts, and sometimes your tongue will get really loose in the process. And that's what's going on with me. Please deal with my ass, okay? Please deal with my ass. Um, on a serious note, it's very interesting, guys, to do what I'm doing. And you got to understand that, that I'm really, not the fact that, okay, I'm doing these things. And it's like, wow, look what I can do. No kind of shit. Like, y'all y'all know Rashida is not like, you know, I'm not like that. It's just the fact that I'm getting out of my system. It's almost like taking a poop or a piss or spitting or whatever kind of a leash that you do naturally. It's like for artists, I just feel like I'm getting stuff out of my system. And it feels really great doing it. It just feels really good doing it. To be able to see it on your screen, I created that. And more than me creating the aspect of something like this, it's just the fact that I'm getting something out of my system. It's like, okay, uh, I, I can imagine this world where underwater we fight crime. Not really crime, but we do justice for a government that we that we belong to. Kind of like if you look at space with Star Trek, they're the U.S. Enterprise or whatever have you like that. So we, so I can make something like that, and to get it out of my system that this can be. It's amazing. And then being able to bring it to you guys and let you guys see it and let you guys experience it is amazing. Also, and that goes with this show and especially next week. Next week is this the main show. And I definitely want you guys to be there to see that. Okay? That's the end that's the um the 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 documentary about um, science fiction. Along with the animation, the anime, what y'all looking at on the screen right there, Aqua Rangers RYS. So, I'm really excited about all of this. You know, it just gets me a, a, a you're in a high, and I just can't come down off this high. You know, I just really can't come down off this high, and it makes me feel good to do it. So, just understand that about me, and because some things are well let's go into detail and let me just bring it to you get it out of my system all right now take a look at this now first we got black tips white tips and gray reef sharks 
See, it's what's interesting about these sharks is that I'm finding out so much about them. When you uh, talk about sharks in general, I'm finding out that they're not all predators. They predators. They 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 really they really are, but they're not, guys. I mean, not the way this drill that's drilled in our head that they're they're, they're going to eat us when they see us and shit like this only when provoked or something like that that's all when they hungry or whatever and that's when they start going off okay sweetie we get the point with that that shit right there now flip it right here because this is a show right here we're going to be talking about all of these kind of things right here so what i want you to do is i want you to sit back relax and we're going to go through some very interesting topics about underwater life and look at some good pictures and I want to bring up some cameras also that, that that's interesting just in case you have a a um, idea some kind of like a journalist I bone a journalist bone in your body then maybe you want to do something with your life now these underwater cameras that you can take underwater and take pictures now I don't know I know for a fact that in, in um and uh, the land down under Australia, there's a lot of sea life under there. They, they got um, countless of documentaries about underwater sea life. Um, um, about you know, Australia got really amazing in South America, also. So, I don't know if you're on the east side or where you can go to get these um, fascinating um, pictures with these cameras. But there are stuff, there are, and maybe I can bring that on the show too, sweetheart. I could bring that on the show for these guys to let you know if you are interested in going underwater or whatever, to take uh, uh, aqua pictures, sea life pictures. What, what's a good camera to use or where to go to do it? Because I know they got scourges and tours where they can take you underwater and just enjoy these things. So sit back and relax because we're going to have fun. Now. Now understand where there are sharks, there's everything else. Sharks are a clear sign that the environment is undisturbed by man, of course. Because when man steps on to something, for some reason everything changes. For as, and even if they don't do even if man go to a place and just start picnicking, it would just change. The animals would react to it. So Sharks, when you see them around, that means the area is fresh, it's fertile, it's, it's rich in, in uh, marine culture, it's very rich in it. Specifically in the South Pacific, they call it the underwater Eden. It's where humans rarely venture out and sharks rule. I mean, sharks are just all over the place. That's what you know is untouched by man. And you know what? I'm so glad to bring this on RBT. I'm really glad to bring this because I don't think we have a fish show on RBT whatsoever. I think this is our first one. Yeah, this is our first fish show really on RBT. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to have other things on here also. I am. I'm going to have other things other than fish on here. That's very interesting. But primarily it's going to be fish ruling this. No doubt about it. Because I don't have a fish show. Um, I don't have a place on RBT where it's this coconut crab. That's a coconut. They call it a coconut crab. It was interesting about the coconut crab. It's very intelligent. I mean, it will it, if it sees something that doesn't, that's not, that's like different than everyday life where it's around. It will, it will stick around and see what's going like it's been newsy. So it was like if a person there investigating or doing some marine research. The coconut crab would just stand by and keep watching the whole time the person <laughs> is around. They just like kind of newsy. So they're very intelligent. This is an award winning show. This this right here, this was part of an award winning um, piece. It says, first place national ranking underwater photography 2017. Brazilian Championship of Underwater Photography. So this happened in 2017. This is one of those pictures right here. Now, now that looks like a related to, I don't know the name of that fish right there. But it looks related to the tiger fish. The tiger fish. It's very, it's very aggressive fish. It really is. 
but it's pretty to see the, the, the bright colors like that and it's just immaculate it's just really immaculate to look at this octopus right here is very imma immaculate also the the lucre's geist is this called a, a stomach a stomach stomach pot pots a stom at a pot stomach a pot it's called the stomach a pot <laughs> I swear to God, S T O M A T O P O D S, stomata pots. That's what it's called, but it's an octopus. And to see it in that array of color right there, there's one thing about octopuses that really is that's really interesting about them is that they come in all shapes, of forms, sizes, and colors. It's not just one. I mean, it's, it's a variety of different styles of octopuses. It's a stomach to pots, uh, but it's still a uh, basic octopus. You can look at the, I mean, the color's like a cheetah. Yeah, it's almost like a cheetah-ish uh, color there. Really amazing to look at also. Stomach to pots. These are just basic angelfish. These are, now these remind me of angelfish. I know they ain't no angelfish, but if you have a tropical aquarium, there's no denying that you can't have fish like that in it. Now they're called angel fish. Now, Rashid always said uh, we always have to have an angel fish in our aquarium. It's just part. It makes the aquarium. If you don't have an angel fish, then you're not really making the aquarium. You got. Well, I got. It's a few angel uh, fish that I have to have in my aquarium. I'm not gonna go into all the names, but this is one of them that looks like this. It's called an angel fish, but this is not. I don't think they angel fish, but. Because these are salt water. Angel fish is fresh water. Yeah, angel fish are fresh water that you can have in your aquarium. These are salt water. Here's the difference. Salt water and fresh water that you can have in your aquarium more. They say uh, fresh water is bullshit and salt water is the real fucking thing. Well, in, in some case, it, it, it depends on how you like your uh, marine aqua life. Uh, I love them all. I do. But I know that salt water fish are very difficult to take care of. I do know that, no doubt about it. So, getting back to these sharks right here. Now, these sharks right here, again, doesn't necessarily mean that they're gonna attack your each, especially the the, uh, the white uh, the white tips and the black tips. Actually, they're kind of friendly in a way. They actually kind of friendly in a way. And then you could go to some uh, resorts. You go scuba diving and you can take pictures and so forth like that of these monaculate creatures. Um, but the great white one is the one you got to fear and stuff like that. We already got that. Take a look at um, this picture right here. Now this right here can be photoshopped. It looks photoshopped, whatever. But look, at, look, read the, the, what it says. Model Megan Haney Greer lies in a field of southern stingrays. South, North, I'm sorry, North Sound, Great Grand Cayman I Island. Grand Cayman Island. I don't know. Um, I don't know if that's South uh, Pacific. I don't know. But it, the photograph is by David Doblin, and uh, it looks like a real, actual, uh, a picture. But it's high. She's highlighted to be a little bit brighter. I guess that makes it look Photoshop, but yet and still, yet and still, you don't see these stingrays attacking her or even thinking about attacking her, and that's and that's pretty amazing, guys. That these rumors are in our head that these animals will kill us or that because of past associations with whoever. That's not necessarily the case. You just gotta understand and learn how they are. And you can venture out and take pictures and explore and grow your horizons and your marine and, uh, curiosity of being a marine scientist. You can. You really can. Now let's draw our attention to a handy helper in our lives. The camera. Just the press of a button and the moment is caught, frozen forever. In the beginning of the 19th century, it was a dream to do this. Oh, the camera, guys. We take it for granted every day. 
There is a camera in almost each and everybody's house. We don't think twice about it. We just grab it whenever we need it. That's if we need it at all, you know. This marvelous box brings an awesome world into our hands. But think for a second, what exactly is the camera? In definition, a camera is an optical instrument for recording or capturing images, which may be stored locally, transmitted to another location or both. The images may be individually still photographs or sequences of images constituting videos or movies. With that being said, you cannot deny that this is a fabulous invention. You can do so much with this, guys. Your world can change with this. You can take it and create for yourself a new career. And it will surpass a hobby if you allow it to. But you gotta want it to. Coming like the octopus in all kinds of shapes and sizes, one could get really attached to the camera. Using one the right way brings richness of every sort into your life. Whether underwater or above, the camera is an instrument to consider when it comes to enhancing your art tree. Take it with you day to day, just in case you come across something richly inspiring. The camera can be a spectacular motivator. If you can't draw or paint, feel free to let the camera do it for you. Because one thing you'll learn, the camera can do your art creating. Become one with it. You'll be amazed at the results, guys. When it's all said and done, see life with a camera goes hand in hand. Exploring is an effective way of educating yourself. Believe me, we do it all the time around here. Every chance I get, I explore with my camera and my pen and my paper. And who knows, in your case, if your destiny isn't above water, maybe it's beneath it. Take care, guys. This has been an RVT Rashid's Video to Social Media Television Production.
Can somebody give these girls some socks? Good girl. This program was brought to you by Rashid's Cyber Rock Films in conjunction with YouTube and Google Plus and social media plug out. It's all about change, real change. Peace. You're watching RBT. This RVT Rashid's Video 2 Broadcasting is brought to you partly by the Rashid and Jan Show and by delicious refreshing strawberry milk. Drink an explosion of strawberry flavor in every drop. So like Rashid and Jan say, drink up! You're watching RVT Rashid's Video 2. Oh, what an atmosphere. You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletube Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? You're watching Rashid's RVT. Isabella, Rashid's startling adventurous computer novel created and written by Rashid. A Rashid Greek mythology story narrated by Rashid himself. Now streaming on RVT Rashid's video tube. Come follow along today. Controversial. Defiant. Supernatural. Or subliminal are just a few discussional qualifications that's found on Rashid's RVT documentaries, sharply enlightening your environment around you. A fascinating look at the world around us. Hi, I'm Rashid. Whether newsworthy or not, join us as we tackle some of the most questionable topics of our time on Rashid's documentaries. Now streaming on RVT. Yeah, I could cover that.
Why is delicious hot oatmeal so good for so many families? Oatmeal is rich in protein. A breakfast with delicious oatmeal with milk and sugar for a family of four provides as much total protein as six average eggs. As much total protein as 18 pieces of toast. And almost as total protein as 18 strips of bacon. That's why your family get that wonderful stick to the ribs feeling with hot oatmeal. That wonderful feeling of well-being with only one minute of actual cooking time. So be sure your family get the protein they need with the delicious hot breakfast of hot oatmeal. Just go over to www.oatmeal.org. That's www.oatmeal.org. Look on your social devices. It's a bird. It's a plane. No, it's my cheese mansion's mouse. And I want to help you guys get a good night's rest. Take a look. Oh, my back. Oh. Oh. Why should you guys suffer with stiff back, achy joints, and so on from a worn out mattress? There are hundreds of affordable mattress dealers in your area, and all is needed is you. Reliable mattresses that fit your comfort level. Spring design style, chic and firm. Thank you, Rushy Mattress Mose. Anytime, an RET ad is worth two in a hole. And speaking of ads, don't forget about this one. And size your bedding up for comfort. A new mattress and a good night's rest awaits you. Just go to www.mattress.com. That's www.mattress.com. Uh, anyway! Next on RVT Rashid's video too. It's the Rashid and Jan show. Following that is Rashid Cyber 2. Having a keen eye for Rashid entertainment isn't hard to do, especially when you're here on RVT with Rashid all the time. 